Welcome to Java Programming by TutorialsInHand.com In the previous video tutorial we have learned how to print a simple hello world statement in Java. In this tutorial we are going to see the difference between print and print ln that we have used to print hello world. So if you want to see the previous video tutorial you can find it here we have already embedded it in the website. So let's move on to see what is the difference between print and print ln. In the previous video we have used print ln to print hello world. Uh, so what if we used print? Let's have a look at below program to see the difference. So let's not have a look at this place. Let's better go to eclipse and see it in the real world. So how the real world scenario would be? Suppose in the previous video we have only used this one to print hello java world now if we run this program we will see hello java world printed on the console now suppose we have to print multiple lines or let's first understand what if we used if we used just print instead of print ln so remove ln from here save it and run again Hey, we got the output hello java world again so what difference does it make is there any difference we will see the difference when we try to print multiple lines now suppose we try to print another line say i am learning java so to do that just take system.out.println write ciso and then press ctrl plus tab you will get uh, suggestions from that select sys out the first one that you can uh, that you are seeing the when you select sys out you will get system dot out dot print ln and within that write your statement i am learning java so this is the statement we we are going to print two statements now the first one is using system dot out dot print and the second one is using system dot out dot print ln save it and run it so what we are getting is hello java world and then i am learning java on the same line just following the hello java world but what we wanted is we wanted i am learning java to be printed on the next line isn't it so you can see if you if you are using print so the immediately following statement that is immediate following system dot out dot print ln statement is printed just after it but if we if we use ln instead of print and then save it and run the program let's see what we get hey we got it on the next line isn't it so this is what we wanted so this is the difference between print and print ln when you use ln you are giving the instruction to print the following statement on the next line and if we use just print in uh, our system dot out dot print so we will get each and everything written on the same line isn't it now if we add again another statement say after this I will learn Python now save it and execute it you will see each and every statement getting printed on the same line one following the other and what if we want after this I will learn Python to be printed on the next line after I am learning Java then what you need to do is you need to include print ln in system dot out dot print so if you save this one and execute this program what you will get you will get hello Java world and I am learning Java on the same line and after this I will learn Python will be printed on the next line let's execute this one and see we are getting hello Java world and I am learning Java on the same line and I after this I will be learning Python is printed on the next line so now by now you would have understood if you want I am learning Java to be printed on a separate line that is on the next line after hello java world so what you need to do 
I guess you have got it now that you need to include ln in your sys out statement. So if you execute now, you will see each and every statement printed on separate lines, isn't it? So ln means you will be printing the statements on the next line. If you hover your mouse over print ln, you will see some suggestions about this print ln. What it is saying is it prints a string and then terminate the line. That means when one string is printed, that means if you have printed hello java world and then the line will be terminated and then if you write separate line it will be printed on the next line but if you write just print and then hover your mouse over print you see what it is written it prints a string it just prints a string it is not terminating the line isn't it that is why we get if we use print for each and every statement that is why we get each and every statement printed on the same line so i guess by now you have understood the difference between print and print ln isn't it thank you for watching this video we will see you in the next video tutorial and in the program where we will see how to take input from the user okay so till then thank you